All right, everyone, welcome back. LQTY is getting a nice pump here. We are above the 200-day moving average. Just peeking our head over the 382 here. We did get all the way up to the 0.5 almost, but ultimately this is turning into a wick already. Uh, and we'll see if it can maintain the level here. If you can stay above 140 on liquidity here, then I would say you're good to go to higher price targets. But there is a good chance this is your top. Uh, depending on how the rest of the day goes it is a news day and we'll see if you can hold on to 139 140 uh, then you're good to go like I said but if you do end up falling back below that then you have your 200 and your 100 day moving average here uh, if you could potentially catch one of those as support there's a chance you get a bounce back up and you may start going higher over that 140 area but from where you are right now over the next three and a half hours or so just watch 127 down to about 121 if you can hold anywhere in there for support uh, that is a good sign that you could push higher but if you come down here about 15 percent and you take out that 120 level uh, your next support is 109 down here at the 236 for about a 23 24 percent drop uh, if that is going to be your top here so uh, what to take away from this video is uh, this nice pump here and you really want to stay over 140 if you should stay over 140 she's bullish and she's going to start going or at least uh, over this resistance here and it's going to start uh, getting a leg up here. But Haiganashi, of course, is printing green. But if you can get back over this level here at 140 and at least go sideways, that is a good step in the right direction to eventually start going up. Uh, so we'll see how it plays out. We'll leave it at that on LQTY. Hopefully that helped. And we will see you in the next one. Good luck, everyone. Peace out. Thank <laughs> you.